Hey guys, um, I'm going to show you a little basic beaver trapping situation. Beaver season's not in here in Ohio, but gun can't do anything with them until the day after Christmas. But what we got here is I got a beaver problem here. Landowners got a hold of me, and they all they're doing is breaking dams, trying to fight an endless battle that's not working. But what we got here is we got two ponds. One, this is the main pond, spring fed, so it's always gonna have be full. Um, then this here is the overflow pond, and the beaver are damming up the overflow pond, and it's causing a big mess, and they're afraid they're gonna get a, in a heavy rain, they'll get a washout on their dam here, and end up losing it. But I'll show you here what we got going on, just some basics on what you can look for if you're going to trap beaver. Uh, what we got here, here's the spillway that they keep plugging up. One of the spillways from the first pond that they keep plugging up. As you can see, it's just a big pile of mud where the landowners keep digging it out. Mud and sticks. But it's kind of a lost cause here because when he comes into a spillway like this, he comes in with a mouthful of sticks and mud. And he basically is going to set your trap off. Anyway, you can set a leg hold with a drown cable on it and kill him that way. I have killed him that way. But your best bet here, and I'll show you, it's pretty self-explanatory what he's doing here. We have a crossover right here where he's crossing right here. Going in anywhere on this side, but it's pretty much a guaranteed funnel right into there. He's crossing right into there. He's going into that. So that's a good little spot to kill him right there. And then we have a caster mound here where they're crossing over to. You can see the caster mound right here. And then another crossing where they're leaving the caster mound. And then another crossover right here, kind of telltale. It's actually a good location because the way it steps down to put in a leg hold and with a drown cable on it, once you run a drown cable down into there or you run a snare there and just catch him with that, with there on a snare. This right here is pretty well, as you can see, he's using this a lot. You can see where he's drug, where it's such lighter colored mud down in there. He's dragging as he runs his body down through there. That, a 330 would fit in there perfectly with no wiggle room around it. Set it just underneath the surface of the water right down into here. Actually, put just lay a drive stick just to make sure that he goes under it. But I'm sure he would as he came up into it. But you can see there's these tracks right there where he's pushing up out of it. But here comes the day after Christmas. We're going to slip in here and set some sets in put some sets in, put a few snares in, see what we can do, try to take care of this problem for these landowners. It's a pretty pond down in here. I'd hate to see it get ruined, but we'll let you know, see how things go.